Today's demonstration is the Devault DW615 router. It's yellow, it's got a little thing you can turn, on off switch, little temperature gauge down the side, going from naught up to 50, some dorsal gripping appendages, some more things you can twist, and a little side guard to go in a straight line. Let's take it out. Ah. You have a nice little collection of router bits of all various shapes and sizes with a nice little picture to show you what they all look like but they never really do end up looking like the pictures but a nice little set and it was fairly cheap as well unlike the Devault tool right that's enough of that right this is now how you change the router bit little black thing you push down and get the spanner in and undo it this I don't know why they have to make these things so awkward. Why can't they put a little quick release on it? Slide it out. Slide the new one in. Push down and then proceed to flumsily do it up. But make sure that it is nice and tight because you don't want to have it flying out halfway through a job and taking your toe off and ricocheting up and taking your eye out. That would put a bummer on the day. And there we go. Job done. <laughs> Next, you have to know what height you want to set it at. And as this is just a little demonstration, you slide this, this piece, whatever you call it, up to the height you want. I'm going wrong. Right, and then I want it like that. And then tighten that up. So the bit then stays proud of, I don't know, I'll call it a table. Right, now we are almost ready to, to start. But, first of all, don't forget to plug it in. Here's been chosen a bit of a shitty piece of wood for my demonstration because it's not coming out how I planned. <laughs> 